Well, hi there. Did you know that back in 1990, the population of Queen Creek was about 2,600 people? In fact, this whole entire area here, this was all a farming community. Heck, we didn't even get our first traffic light until about 2001 or so. But fast forward a few years, and all of a sudden, our population is approaching 70,000 people and growing every day with all of this new development that's going on. You know, Queen Creek is home to an awful lot of uh, regular production type builders building beautiful neighborhoods. But did you know that Queen Creek is also home to some pretty pricey and exclusive real estate? Well, I thought in today's video it might be kind of fun to take a look back at the year that just ended, 2021, and bring to you the top 10 most expensive homes that sold in Queen Creek for 2021. Now, if that's the kind of information you're looking for, stick around because we're getting started right now. Well, hi and welcome back. My name is John Farron. I'm a realtor with Home Smart Lifestyles right here in Queen Creek. And I thought it'd be kind of fun in this video, like I said in the, in the opening, to go back to last year and take a look at the top 10 priciest homes. And so, without any further fanfare, let's just get into it. So coming in at number 10 is this beautiful new build custom home that's located in the Santan Sunrise Estates neighborhood, which is on Riggs Road, east of Higley. Now this home was originally put on the market at $1.89 million, and it ultimately sold for a little bit less than that at $1.825 million. This home is 5,550 square feet. It has four bedrooms, five bathrooms, and a two car garage. Now it sits on a lot that is about three quarters of an acre in size. And in the backyard, of course, there's the diving pool, a jacuzzi, fire pit, and a built-in barbecue. Number nine is a stunning custom home as well, and it's in the Pecans neighborhood, which is on Chandler Heights, just west of Ellsworth Road. In fact, four of the top 10 homes are in the Pecans neighborhood. Yeah, it's kind of a big deal. This home was originally listed for $2.1 million, and guess what? That's exactly what it sold for. This home was built in 2013, and it has 5,839 square feet, and it has five bedrooms, four and a half bathrooms, a den and a loft, as well as a three car garage. And check out this large open laundry room. This thing even has a laundry chute. And the backyard, it's pretty incredible and it features a pool with a custom sunshade, a built in barbecue area, a pizza oven and a fire pit. And it has huge covered patios. And next up on the list is number eight. Now this is a custom home, and in fact, all of them are gonna be custom built homes. And this one's located in Saddlewood Estates, which is on uh, Sossaman Road, south of Chandler Heights. This home was originally listed for just $100 less than $2.8 million, and it sold for $2.2 million. Built in 2020, it's a 4,652 square foot home, and it has four bedrooms, four and a half bathrooms and a four car garage. Now it sits on an acre lot and it also comes with a separate pool house or you could use it as a casita. Coming in at number seven is this home in the gated White Wing community at Haas and Riggs Roads. Now this home was originally listed for 2.5 million and it sold for just short of 2.4 million dollars. It's 5,550 square feet, and it has four bedrooms, five bathrooms, and a four-car garage. Now, it sits on a lot that is about three-quarters of an acre. Now, take a look around here just a little bit because the listing agent added in the description that living here is like being on a five-star vacation at home. Now, number six in the countdown brings us to this stunning designer home in the groves at Queen Creek, and the groves is located near Haas and Chandler Heights Roads. Now this home originally went on the market at $2.25 million and it ultimately sold for just a little bit more than $2.4 million with multiple offers. It's 6,229 square feet and it has five bedrooms, five bathrooms, a den, and garages that will accommodate up to seven cars. Now it sits on a lot that's about three quarters of an acre in size and this home was built in 2018. 
All right, we are halfway through this list. You know, if you could tell me in the comments below kind of what you think about these homes, that'd be great. Um, also, if you're finding value here, go ahead and hit that like button. And to uh, continue to see great content like this, go ahead and click the subscribe button so that you're notified every time a new video gets uploaded. All right, moving along, number five in the countdown brings us to this incredible home. This home is located off of Riggs Road, west of Power Road, in the exclusive Water Ski Lake community of Santan Lakeside Estates. The home was originally listed for $2.49 million, and that's exactly what it sold for after being on the market only 12 days. This home is 5,450 square feet, and it has six bedrooms, five bathrooms, and a four-car garage. It was built in 2013, and it sits on a lot that's just a little bit more than an acre in size. Now check out the backyard. It was designed for outdoor entertainment with a pool and various water features. There's a basketball and tennis court, a spa, outdoor kitchen, putting green, slide, and trampoline. That should probably be enough to keep you busy for a while, right? All right, let's move to number four. Number four also comes to us from Santan Lakeside Estates. Now this home was originally listed for $3.25 million and it sold for $2.8 million. Now built in 2014, this home is 6,232 square feet and it has five bedrooms, five and a half bathrooms, and a five car garage. Now it sits on an acre lot. This is a waterfront home that sits right on the shore of the private 13 acre lake here which boasts 236 feet of lakefront beach, hence the name Santan Lakeside Estates. And this home not only comes with a great view of the lake, but it has a boathouse equipped with a hydro lift so that you can raise your boat into and out of the water. However, I don't think the boat was included in this sale though. Number three on the list takes us right back to the cons. This home originally hit the market for $1 short of $3 million. I guess $2,999,999 sounds and feels maybe a little bit better than $3 million, I don't know. But anyway, it sold for $2.875 million. This home is 7,644 square feet and it has five bedrooms, seven bathrooms and a den as well as a four car garage. Now it sits on a lot that's about three quarters of an acre, but the empty lot next door was also included in the sale. Now, every bedroom in this home has its own full private bathroom that also comes with its own washer and dryer and a walk-in closet. And the backyard, check this out, it's really your own private resort. And as a side note to number three, this home is currently owned by my optometrist. You know, maybe I should have been an optometrist. All right, let's go to number two. The second most expensive home to sell in Queen Creek in 2021 is this beautiful home. Now this home sold for $2.985 million, which was actually the original listing price, and it only spent three days on the market. It's 8,170 square feet and it has six bedrooms, five bathrooms, and a den, as well as a four car garage. It sits on a lot that's not quite an acre in size and it was built in 2018 and how about this kitchen all of the best appliances including an electrolux built-in oversized refrigerator thermidor gas stove and not one but two dishwashers and then really the backyard just kind of speaks for itself and now this brings us to the number one most expensive home to sell in queen creek in 2021 drum roll please listed by an awesome agent from my own office this gorgeous custom home in the pecans is only two doors away from our number two entry. Originally listed for $4.695 million, this home sold for $4.325 million, which is almost a million and a half more than the neighbor's house. Now let's take a look and see what makes this home so special. Built in 2020, this is the largest home in the countdown, coming in at 11,214 square feet of living space, and it has six bedrooms, five and a half bathrooms, and a five car garage. It also has a bonus or game room, exercise and sauna room, a media room, and anyone up for some basketball? 
Now the landscaping here, it's a blank slate for the new owner. So they can come in and design and enjoy it in their own personal style. So there you have a quick rundown of the top 10 most expensive homes that sold in Queen Creek. Now, in addition to my optometrist, some of these homes were owned by business moguls and a couple of them were actually uh, sold by professional sports athletes. But you know what? You don't have to be an NFL player to come and live in Queen Creek. In fact, we had 2,261 homes that sold uh, within the MLS during 2021 and the prices ranged between $185,000 all the way up to the $4.3 million home. So you see, there is something here for everyone. And so if you're thinking about maybe buying or selling a home here in Queen Creek or the Southeast Valley, or maybe you just want a little bit more information, well, I invite you to call, text, or email me, or you can even leave a comment down below because I do read and respond to every comment. All right, and so with that, thank you for watching, and I can't wait to see you in the next video.